I think the ESE role is, is the heart of what we do at Rackspace. If, if you think about it, I, I view the ESE on my team as if I were a standalone business, they're, they're the CTO. They're the CTO, the architect, the designer, the sysad, all rolled up into one. The account managers and the enterprise support engineers truly own the customer relationship. Customers interface with hundreds of rackers, thousands at times, but they really make the difference. They quarterback in a lot of cases. They are really the face of rack space. So when things are going well, typically they've added that fanatical touch. And when things are you know, potentially not, or customers are encountering challenges or growth pains, it's the account managers and the enterprise support engineers collaborating that really makes the difference. My customers see myself and my account manager as, as rack space. And so I have, to, uh, I have to build that trust with them. And when something goes wrong, I have to, I have to mend the relationship and make sure that they can still trust that we're going to get things done for them. And so to me, that's a, it's, not, it's not a burden. It's a, it's a badge of pride that, that they can sleep well at night because they know that I'm, I'm watching their environments. To me, the, the best thing about the job is really just the day-to-day -day opportunity that I have to learn and grow at Rackspace, right? Our, our product and service portfolio is ever-changing. And uh, my customers, they want to stay on the front line of those things, right? So I always have a chance to deploy something new, which I need to learn about, right, and understand so that I can make sure that I can support it for their business. Um, and, and that's amazing. So just being able to kind of gather that information and keep growing on a day-to-day -day without really having to put a lot of effort into it is really one of the best things about the job. Technologies that I've seen ESCs really kind of become familiar with throughout the course of their ESCs job is very wide. Through the course of their job uh, at Rackspace, they're going to get incredibly smart on networking, on storage, on virtualization, on our cloud products. If you want to be in a position where you have the opportunity to grow, learn new technologies, be on the forefront of things that we're doing in this industry, um, and really you know, have a customer service uh, heart, then I would say this is the perfect role for you. I mean, you get you know, not only to, to kind of deal one-on-one -on -one with these clients as their uh, point of contact here at Rackspace from a technical perspective, but also you, you have the freedom to handle these accounts in the way that they want to be handled. So there's no guidelines, there's no policy for how we do business. It's all about kind of integrating with these customers and really becoming a part of their team to the point where you're doing business the way they want to do business. And that freedom to me is integral. What I've found most important is finding ESCs that are lifelong learners. They are cutting edge, they are pushing their limits, being 24-7 to our customers, yet they themselves are stretching. Um, a lot of our ESCs know how to network well, others learn how to network as they get here, but they always learn how to work well with each other, so it's really truly like a grassroots type of job. And so those ESCs that do that are very, very successful here.